Hello everyone. Welcome to the quick tutorial of call to test feature available in Zephyr Enterprise. Call to test feature provides you with an ability to insert one test case into another, which allows you to save time and also maintain consistency. So in this tutorial, you'll see I have a test case called as login to system. It has four steps. Uh, and I have another test, which is called as user login to the Chrome browser. In this, I want to use the step from my previous test case. So what I do is I add my first test step as user opens the browser. I add a new step and using the call to test link, I will select the test case or uh, the test cases that I have access to. And those would be added as a test step within my test case. So as you can see, all the four steps are available here. And those are listed are coming directly from the other test case that I had. I also have an option to call more than one test case. So I can add that by using the button available over here. Or as you saw in this case, we added using the call to test link available at the top over here. Hello everyone. In this tutorial, we'll take a look at how a test execution is done when call to test feature is used. We have a test case where call to test has been used and it has four steps. To execute a test case in Zephyr Enterprise, you have to add a cycle, provide the start and end date, and then add a phase to select the repository, what phase you're going to be executing. Once the test case has been assigned, it's ready for execution. Once you are ready for execution, you select the test case that you need to execute. You can see the steps are appearing here as each and individual step. Even from the test that has been called, you can see the steps are listed as individual steps in this test case. And you can also see the test case name and the test case version available. That allows you to identify where the steps are coming from and what version has been used. This is very helpful in scenarios where you have more than one test case called within your test case. 